I feel so often that entrepreneurs are focused on this huge vision and then you get stuck in actually in that planning process or creating the plan that you're actually not spending your time executing the plan. And that's not how it works. Like every single day you have to step into execution. And as we're bringing on financial institutions, we've got to be able to pivot to say, this is, you know, the modules that they're liking. This is a piece of data. This is what they want more of. This is what we thought they wanted, but this is actually what they're not using. So we can take that feedback, especially from our early customers and adopters to be able to build upon that roadmap. I'm really fascinated by your process. Can you tell us a little bit more about how you get started creating a roadmap? It's about just getting your idea from your head onto paper, whatever that looks like for you. I would really focus on what is the product that you're looking to build and go focus on creating out that roadmap and getting the right people in the room. You cannot build a roadmap by yourself. You do not want to build a roadmap by yourself. So you want to get as many great minds together on helping you build that roadmap and start with a product roadmap first. Once that product roadmap is established, then you go into, okay, what could this look like? Which is exactly why we launched Enterprise first. Because if I was just focused on product, I would just be giving out the word score to every every SMB. And as much as I want to, data is expensive. But who's going to pay my bills are going to be the large institutions. So we're going to go to market with Enterprise first, go build momentum, go build revenue. And from there, then launch to the mission part of the business, which is giving it to all entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm.